Hooray! What is your willpower times five? Uh, where are we? Basic info. Uh, willpower times five is, what is it, 90? Right, roll a 60 or less. This seems a lot easier than the first time you went through it. Yep. Yeah, I'll just do the willpower by five. Oh, I will spend a throw point. Okay. Here we go. Well done. Uh, right. Uh, a ward of D8 Sanity, refill your hand. You are now attuned to the Jewel of Judgment. And in your mind, you know what to do. Mm -hmm. So go ahead and take yeah. your new cards. You also yeah. know this will be harder than anything you've ever done before. Yep. Oh, yeah. It's going to be fucking ugly, you're thinking. This is normally done by um, gods. Well, yeah. Amber Heights. Um, do you guys have any crap cards? I have a limited retrieve and a slip up. I've got two clogging grades, basically. I doubt just... you're going to need the fucking slip up at this point. Uh, round yeah. revision, haste, opponent fails. Good combat hand, but again, you. No, I'll give you each a clogging grade and then just discard something. Okay. <laughs> And I'll get rid of the assistant. The oh, and if you had any insanities, those are gone. <laughs> yeah. Nope. I, I didn't think so. Uh, draw four. Now, this next part, I think I must state: uh, if you fail, you die, and you're gone. Yes. All right. Who has a crappy? Who's got space for a victory prestige module only card? Mm. Just in case I do not succeed, so it's not in my hand. Well, I have no, a okay. limited retrieve and the yeah, so, grade, so probably yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Well, James okay. mostly got a combat hand, but he yeah, yeah, yeah. Apparently, you don't need to do any combat on this. It's yeah. just a pause drain for reasons like climbing tables. Mm -hmm. Being flung off bridges by horrible old men from scene twenty-four. So yeah, so I'll give you the give you that to hang on to because I had to give him Jay case. a refill if he's like, I saw that on the map. Oh, I remember it. I'd be <laughs> like, oh. Alrighty, away we go. All right, so. Let's start. I start walking a new pattern in the shape of me. Yep. He what he's doing is he's using the jewel of judgment, which he's like keeping up, and it's almost like an uh, invisible beam is hitting, and you're seeing a new pattern starting to form, kind of like uh, Tron motorcycles and stuff as he's walking. So, right, what is your strength? One hundred. So ten down. Roll a forty or less. Yeah. Yeah, pieces. <laughs> could be worse. You could be tainted by logers trying this. Oh. Now, what am I doing? I'm going to the wrong tab. I just uh, slash roll D100. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I just will do the new school. Yeah. Humble. One <laughs> he goes, point. He dies. Yeah. Oh wait. No, oh, 40. 40 works. Yes. I don't know why you're doing oh, you're just taking new skill button. Okay, cool. What is your endurance? My endurance is 73. <coughs> 73, me. call it 75. 110 minus 75 is is that 40? 415. Hold on, calculator. That's what it is. Fucking math, god damn it. Don't ask me to do math. One turn minus 75, 35. So roll a 15% or less. Good luck. Yeah. This is where the uh, old hero point hose starts. Fun. 
see. Oh my god, he got it. This would have been the end of the dock. Uh-huh. Ready for the next yeah. one? Yeah, that's why I said I think I've got a bit better chance of this than you. What's your willpower times five? Yeah. This is the bit where you beat me, but yeah. Uh, willpower, t willpower times five is 90. Oh, that's 20 difference. Roll a 30 or less. One, two, three, four, five, six. No, How many hero points do you have left just for seven, dramatics? And the three. Holy fuck. Eight. Nine. And last zero point. So this is it. No. He goes, ah, turns sideways, disappears. The whole pattern collapses. The jewel goes, tink, 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 on the floor. Very sorry, sir. That's right. Right. <clears throat> Okay. You just watched your best friend die. Please give me a sanity roll. Yeah, you say. <laughs> One point toward fucking best friend dying? I don't know. It's the way he would have wanted to go, horribly. Um, okay. I go pick up the gem. Okay. Uh. Look around. Fucking dark. It's just, yeah. <clears throat> Nothing's going on here. <laughs> he was so fucking close, too. Hmm. No bad a re roll cards or anything, huh? Assumably not. You stand there holding the jewel judgment, possibly the ultimate power in the galaxy, and you are totally unsure as to what to do. Or, yeah. Rasslin. Well, the problem is, is that I can't get him out. Because he can't, I can't walk, I can't, well, this isn't big enough to walk Shadow. I can't Trump out. Mm-hmm. I don't have a Trump of him. So I can't contact him anyway. I can try to sketch this place so I can come back to it. That's only useful for like a week. And if I take this right back to powers that be, they're just going to take it. Wrestling Rad looks at you with hope in his <laughs> eyes. Uh, I will sketch this place. I'll take whatever time I need to sketch the inside of here. Okay. Wow. 
one hour. Two. Three. Four. He sits there for hours going, no, no. Yeah. Like, I'm just going to do this till I can get it. Like, I don't give a shit, like, how long it takes. I understand. There we go. Six uh -huh. hours later, he's finally done fucking drawing. Yeah, lovely. <laughs> See, now my problem is, is I don't know how to get you out. Hmm. Well, there is one way you could get him out, but it'll probably kill both of you. Unless... Right, which is why I'm not going to do that. So what are the options? I'm wondering if I got back here with him, if he could gate you somewhere else. Because I think he has. I'll be back. I take out my trump of uh, the PC house and MMO, and I step through. Right. He makes a big three-dimensional uh, picture appear in midair, and then he walks through and is gone in a shower of rainbows. <laughs> 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 I'm giving him a card for that look like uh, Hello, hello. <laughs> nada. Of course it's a nada. You sit there going, wonder if there's any tucker. Fuck. <laughs> you look around the bare metal fucking walls and shit. Nothing to eat, nothing to drink. Sitting in the corner watching him fucking sketch for six hours, stomach rumbling, and then he goes, see ya, and leaves. <laughs> oh, I feel really bad for Pete. That is fucking heroic as shit, though. He died a hero's death. Is he gone gone or no? Because... What do you I, think? I try to contact him, no? No. His tarot card is not even cold. What the fuck? Yep. Oh, look, a comfortable bed. Food, drink. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Joe's wrestling rad sitting there <laughs> staring at the metal wall. <laughs> well, it was going all right today until they decided to bring me to the Smurf Village. And I can't contact anybody with the Trumps through the firewall still, right? You can try for a while. No. And even if you could, what good would they do? Because this place is obviously within the firewall. <coughs> you really have come to hate and despise that fucking metal corridor for so many reasons. Wrestling Rad starting to learn to hate it now, too. <laughs> Mm 
The only way I can think of getting him out is if he walks the pattern in the gem, and then we trump out. That's not bad. I go back. I right. He reappears. Bing. Ah. You're not sure why he left in the first place and why you had to spend six hours. You're thinking that he just wanted to gr grab his car keys or something, maybe? All right, so you're going to have to walk pattern so we can get out. Otherwise, I have no idea how to get you out of here. And I am not strong enough to do what he just died doing, and he's as, no, I can't do it yet. So I'm supposed to do what he did? Uh, not the second part, just the first part. <laughs> So look, upon, look inside the gem. I look inside the gem. Okay. You're feeling like your ass is just given a whole new meaning to the word clench. So, um, right. What is your strength? I'm guessing 60. 60. All right. So it's 20 down. You need to roll a 30 or less to just push through this thing with raw strength. And, of course, failure on any one of these equals permanent death. In which case, Rasslin Rad's son or daughter or whatever may have to come back and, well, son, hopefully, will have to come back to him. Right. <laughs> he just goes, ah, and disappears right as soon as he looks into it, he goes, eh. Oh, there he goes. All right. So, 23 makes it. All right. What is your endurance? off the hero point there endurance is 60 okay so same roll 30 or less for endurance this is gonna be a close one oh i made it oh, that nice. time. very nice, nice. what's your new willpower after the adjustment for death at times five Fifty-five. So fifty-five. Uh, that'd be twenty-five. So roll a twenty-five or less. Mm -mm. Uh -huh. Burn a point. Uh huh. I know he doesn't have many points left. Oh, down to five. Okay. Well. Down to four. Come on, 25. Three. You need 25. Oh, 25. Okay. Right. All right, down to three. Hey. hey! All right. All right. And you're in the center of it, and then you stop and... You are now, uh, you are considered to walk the pattern. I'll give you your new skill here. Yes, apparently Rasslin Rad was tougher than anybody thought, even after dying once. That's Australian resistance there. <laughs> <laughs> all right, new skill? Oh, uh, yeah, you got all kinds of new shit now. Let's see here. Yeah, normally people don't do this on their first session, but... Uh, Congratulations. <laughs> and here's your new deal. Copy all that shit. PC house in MMO. <laughs> he grabs, he, he pulls out a card, looks at it, makes the same picture, grabs you, and takes your ass through. You're hmm. back in the MMO world. So copy paste that. I recommend putting it into the spell section for now because it kind of builds like spells and stuff do. Oh, okay. And that is the tragic end of the adventure. So it's a very mixed thing. You did find the thing you wanted. You do have it with you, although possibly whoever sent you that quest will not be fucking happy that you have taken it. And uh, 
uh, you managed to get out of there. Yep. Unfortunately, you lost the great man. Yep. Mm hmm. Oh, and make a note also, uh, Jason, that you are attuned to the Jewel of Judgment. Same with you, Chris. Okay. So did, did I get one ability then? Is this... That's all yeah. one That's all one ability. Yeah, yeah. Okay. It's all, all the one ability. All right. And unfortunately, I have to bounce. I was going to say, that is the end of the session. So if you wanted to do end of mission card play, discard anything you don't want, refill your hands. You're looking for either That's cycling card cards or Peter gave. Huh? Yeah, hang on to that one. Yeah. So prestige module only. Yes, this is definitely a prestige mod. I am I am happy that people did survive it. And yes. It so did not turn out the way I thought it would, but by gosh, it was interesting. So this says it looks like a, it's a hero point for everybody in the party. Mm. Yep, yep. Keep that. And also your clogging grade that you were given, keep that. Uh, and what else do you have, sir? Opponent fails and nada. Toss those two. And All right, draw. I gotta go. Gotcha. Um, I'll talk to you guys another time. Sorry I have to bounce so quickly, but it's late. We usually cool. don't play this long. I'll talk yeah. to you guys later. Ciao. Right. See ya. Catch you, Grace. All right, and then draw two cards, Jason. Let me know what you get. A skill plus ten, and another skill plus ten. All right, so you end up you end up with uh, add five points onto your hero point total. Okay. <clears throat> and which uh, which stats do you have uh, checks in? Essence. Uh, what is your current essence times five? Or what is your essence? Ten. Ten? Right. Uh, roll a 2d6. You want to get a seven. All right. Er erase that check. Do you have any checks in other? Or you should have another check in uh, willpower. Uh, yes, willpower I did. So Roll two d six again. So one thing you can do, which you probably don't want to do at the moment, is if you wanted to, you could spend a hero point to reroll. Yeah, I don't recommend it personally. Yeah, I wouldn't. I wouldn't worry about. I wouldn't. Do it. <coughs> okay. But just something to keep in mind for future. Mm -hmm. so I have. Okay. Yeah. So <coughs> I have to get a seven on that roll to get a mm -hmm. a chance at going up. Gotcha. Yeah. That's that scopes more slowly. All right, so erase that check. Do you have any other statistics checked? No other statistics. Okay. Uh, so next go to your skills that are checked. Okay. And all you got to do is mash the button of the skill and get a red result. That's pretty much it. If you get a red, then it goes up. Okay, so on that, go ahead and roll a D6. So your your rifle skill goes up to sixty one percent. So go ahead and change it in your thing, and that's how they all work. Yep. Yeah. Nice and easy, Pete. I feel horrible for you, but you definitely died the most heroic death ever, trying to make a new fucking world. Yep. In your image. Just did not quite work, but that's the way the dice roll. Unfortunately, sometimes. Oh, uh, the dice fucked you there. I thought you'd get that yeah. for sure. Yeah. So, do you have an idea of your next character, sir? Not at the moment, no. Really not sure yet. Mm -hmm. Something uh, we'll work on later. I was going to say, are you, are, yeah, after you sleep, yeah. Are you scheduled for tomorrow? Yep. It'll be interesting to see what you get then. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, that is a long fucking term character that just bit the dust there, Jay. And he was from a prior campaign, too, I think. Yes, mm -hmm. yes that's right. He had tons and tons of uh, uh, fucking backstory and shit. So I feel really horrible he fucking died. Uh, but 
Okay. It was the risk. Yeah, it was a big risk, that's for sure. Yeah, mm -hmm. just, the dice just did not roll the way we wanted them to, unfortunately. I did not even think of uh, having a, a wrestling walk the pattern in the Jewel of Judgment. I thought Chris would have to make the new pattern and then have him walk that one. But fortunately, Chris uh, uh, thought of that, and I was like, oh, that, that would fucking totally mm -hmm. work. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I didn't have any ideas. <laughs> yeah. Now, yeah, well, they, they, they essentially said, hey, you're brand new. Why don't you come with us on the fucking... One of the big end of series arc quest, huh? Yeah, how about that? That'll be fun. Is, is kind of fitting though that that's the one that Razzle and Rad got dragged along because <laughs> I was telling Logan that was actually part of my bet character's backstories. That's one of the last things he remembered was Jack oh, okay. Swade and Cherry playing with that, <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and he got the fuck out of that universe. Yeah. Yep. The the look on Chris's face when he went in and saw the same setup. <laughs> where the the because uh, what happened in the previous campaign? Did you already hear the story, Pete? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So the guy, yeah. the guy put the gem in there. Mm -hmm. End of world. Yes. Yep. All right. So when a skill is green, then I don't. Yeah, get to level. You do not get a yeah. So basically, the higher your skill is, the harder it is to level it. Mm -hmm. And then after whether you get red or green, after that, take off the check. Gotcha. Yeah, I really love this character sheet. It makes it so easy for new people. There's no fucking question of did I make the skill, did I not, how much did I make it by. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And apparently it's possible to print out the character sheets in case you'd like something, if you survive long enough and you'd like to frame it, put it on the wall. And you can back them up and stuff. Which I might do before deleting it. Mm -hmm. I think that's a good idea. I think it should be immortalized and put on your wall somewhere. It's a hell of a good character. Yes. Other than dying horribly, did you enjoy the adventure, Pete? Yeah, yeah. Complicated enough? Yeah. We almost got there. Mm -hmm. I'm just not the question is, is there a time limit for Doc to do it in, that Doc or whoever has to do it in before things get... Assumably, there's going to be a... Well, there has, assumably, there is a time limit or something for it. Uh, so. Oh, there's machinations within machinations. Yeah, yeah, so that'll be interesting to see. Oh, I'm sure that whoever had the Jewel of Judgment sitting there and uh, all that stuff will not be at all pissed that he took off with the most powerful artifact in the universe. Mm -hmm. I'm sure that they won't be fucking livid with Doc Bolton. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> but I can understand why he decided not to do it. Mm -hmm. I, I did have some really nice rewards uh, if you'd managed to successfully pull that off, though. So... Yeah. Yeah, that's all right. <clears throat> all right, that looks like that's my skills that I did. Cool. Yeah, and you're done. Very good, very good. Yeah. I hope you enjoyed your first uh, session back. Yeah, it was fun. First time playing online like this. Yeah. Hey, a lot of people bitch about it, but honestly, I think it's about as good as uh, being there. Yeah, you know, I think that's, honestly, that's why I was hesitant for a while. It was just the idea it, of playing online didn't really click with me. But then mm -hmm. uh, it can I started hearing more about the game, it, it piqued my interest. Sometimes it can be a little, I was just going to say, sometimes it can be, excuse me, it can be a little harder because you don't always see the men... You know, normally when you're in a playing face to face, mm -hmm. and just when you're in a conversation with people, there you know you pick up on certain things subconsciously right. in that about you know when a pause is or when to talk. So the, <coughs> it's almost there, but yeah, some sometimes it can be not doesn't quite work. Hmm. So, no, but I like it. I like the system with the roles and all that. It makes it real easy. Hmm. So um. Everything. Do you, do you guys have any ideas for the title of the show? 
Because I know Jason's looked through the fucking titles, and so he's got a good idea of all the crazy shit that's on there. I was thinking we could have something something uh, uh, to do with McKay since it's a, it was his swan song type deal. Mm. Yeah, the the only things that were coming to my mind were kind of morbid, like uh, yeah. in with the Aussie, out with the Aussie. <laughs> <laughs> but... Uh... We can come up with something shorter that has that same thing, then that would be fucking great. <laughs> um, Hang on a sec, dogs going burka. Uh-huh. Uh, let's call see. Like McKay's last stand, or McKay yeah. walks the pattern. McKay. Uh, hmm. We could just call it Joshua. Mc- Actually, hold on. We could just call this episode Joshua McKay. <laughs> you could, yes. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's the in loving memory of AOS J O S H U A M C K A Y M A C M A C K A Y A Y. Yep, that's it. There, is there a K in it? Yes. K A Y. Okay. We'll yep. Just call yep. it that. That's easy. Cool. All right. Well, does anybody have anything to say before I turn off the camera? No. No. I shall have to, to think about uh, what to create. Yeah, hopefully you had fun in your first session. Yeah. I hope I get to play with you again. 